as this was the handiwork of the BJP. Uh, of course, these are only, uh, you know, preliminary reports. Uh, obviously, there has to have, uh, there has to be an investigation. Shubhan Jodhikari, on the other hand, has alleged that no less than five BJP workers have been severely injured in the clash. Uh, they, uh, they were, uh, they were beaten up or, or injured by the Trinamool Congress workers and had, and have had to be taken to Kolkata uh, to, uh, to administer treatment uh, to them. Uh, so obviously, uh, you know, things uh, looking, uh, you know, not very uh, good on the ground at this place called Hatuganj. In, 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 in South 24 Pargana, uh, where uh, the, the Trinamool Congress had allegedly uh, put up a roadblock since, uh, uh, for the last several hours now, stopping uh, the BJP workers from reaching the rally van venue, when, as a result of which, uh, uh, given the sign of rapid that you see happening on the street right now, uh, the, uh, the, 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 uh, the cars uh, and shops getting vandalized. Uh, several vehicles being torched. Uh, you know, some of them are alleging that uh, the, 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 the torching of the vehicles have been done by the BJP workers. For the benefit of all our viewers who are now tuning in, it's important to establish the location that uh, this violence has taken place in. As we can see, some very, very disturbing visuals over there. Uh, there's vandalism that's taken place. There's arson, as we can see. Uh, we also are aware that uh, this is close to perhaps uh, uh, Diamond Harbour, where is which was the place uh, where the BJP was supposed to hold its rally. Uh, could you take us through all these details? What are the allegations right now? So far, what has been the action taken by the local administration? Shagato, can you hear me? Uh, yes, um, uh, to answer your question, um, you see, uh, the, the whole, um, you know, ruckus started uh, about uh, about uh, half an hour or so ago when uh, when uh, Agni Mitra Paul, the BJP leader who was present at Shivan Yodhikari's rally venue in, in Diamond Harbour, um, you know, came down to Hatuganj uh, to, uh, to see things for herself as to why the BJP workers were being stopped. Uh, by the Trinomol Congress in the name of a roadblock that was uh, that was put up over there, and uh, that is when uh, the violence broke out when uh, when she engaged, uh, in, you know, in a, in, in, in a conversation, a heated conversation uh, with the with the uh, with the Trinomol Congress uh, with supporters who were putting up that roadblock. What we saw uh, following was uh, massive brick batting that took place uh, from both sides. And, uh, and 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 BJP workers allegedly, uh, you know, uh, taking to rampage uh, and, uh, and 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 destroying uh, you know shops, establishments, uh, vehicles parked on, on on the side of the road, and uh, and and even setting some of these vehicles, uh, especially two wheelers, on fire. Uh, the BJP alleges that uh, you know the, the police uh, remained largely inactive at the time when this uh, this uh, uh, rampage took place and, uh, and and the police and despite the asking for police health and protection the police was nowhere at sight uh, when the rampage was happening we do know now that uh, the large police force a contingent has reached uh, the spot uh, we can also see a bjp party office uh, which has also been uh, badly ransacked uh, uh, allegedly by the by the by the bjp workers so Trinamool Congress the party uh, office uh, ransacked by BJP party workers uh, is what we can see, uh, you know, happening on the ground. On the other hand, Shubhendu Adhikari has clearly said that no, no less than at least five BJP workers have been badly roughed up, injured uh, by uh, by the Trinamool Congress uh, 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 during the course of this uh, uh, of this of this violence. All of them have had to be taken to Kolkata, back to Kolkata to uh, to uh, to administer. Um, uh, you know, uh, medical treatment. Uh, Shubhendu Adhikari, as we know, is now currently headed for this rally venue in, in Diamond Harbour, mm. which is obviously a, 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 a program which the BJP has uh, decided in response to Abhishek Banerjee's, uh, you know, public meeting that right. is taking place in Shubhendu Adhikari's footprint in, in, in Kondai. So obviously, it's a it's a it's a, it's a, it's a battle of uh, uh, of prestige for both uh, the the uh, you know the, the ruling party as well as the primary opposition here in in Bengal. And as we know, that uh, things get uh, you know quickly out of hand when uh, when such things happen. And and uh, it has exactly what has happened on the ground at Hatuganj. 
which is not more than 10 to 12 kilometers from where uh, Shivendra Adhikari is supposed to hold that rally. So uh, the, on the ground, things look pretty tense at this stage, uh, about, uh, about the details of it, as to the number of injured, the kind of uh, you know property that has been damaged, the details of that would emerge in some time. Right now, we can see a large police force on the ground uh, trying to take control of the situation. And That's even it. though you can see that large uh, police force on the ground, so important to talk about uh, whether it is the TMC or the BJP, both have been pulling punches at each other and posing hurdles because, you know, whether it's the TMC or even the BJP, they both had to approach the court to seek permissions. Uh, we do know that the TMC was po uh, posing administrative hurdles as well for the BJP to not organize the rally that, it were, uh, that it's been trying to organize today now. Uh, a that and the build up of the entire narrative and the political rhetoric that we've seen uh, only get more fierce as Abhishek Banerjee uh, also released a video challenging Suvendu Adhikari uh, with regards by using the term uh, himmat or rather you know questioning his masculinity by throwing terms like himmat and come and making it obviously more confrontational something that we already see translate to the ground level as well? Well, obviously, the tone and tenor of, of both parties have been set by their leaders, uh, you know, long before the, the, the two rallies, uh, you know, actually uh, took place uh, and, and were scheduled. So, obviously, we do know that the, uh, the, the, the relationship, the political relationship uh, between the Trinamool Congress and the BJP here in Bengal, especially on the ground, is very, very antagonistic. And, and that is what uh, we see, get, get, you know, get translated uh, on the ground in terms of the kind of violence uh, that we witness uh, during, uh, you know, during these clashes. And, uh, and obviously, as far as the allegations are concerned, um, the, uh, the both sides trading charges at each other, pointing fingers towards each other. Um, and, and, and that is obviously is something that we see uh, in the run-up to the upcoming panchayat mm. polls. It, it's only, it only brings up, uh, you know, ominous signals, uh, mm. uh, gives out ominous signals as to what uh, is, is likely to be in store in the days, weeks and months ahead in the run-up to the panchayat elections. Obviously, it's interesting that you...